Hey, sir. Excuse me. Can I have the incident number? Can I have the incident number to this? No. Why not? None of your business. You're not involved. Oh, it is our business because if we can get into the Freedom of Information Act, it is our business. Wait till you see the shenanigans that the Fort Worth Police Department pulls in this video. Geography is important for this video because we find the Fort Worth Police Department way out of their jurisdiction in a place called River Oaks, Texas. And we find them in a darkened parking lot right here. Five six zero. Oh. We got a whole bunch of them. West eight four two. They trying to hide over here. West eight nine two. West six seven nine. West. Got another one over here. West 842. Excuse me, sir. What what happened? Uh, it's a Fort Worth deal, man. We're just here to assist. Oh, okay. It's a Fort Worth thing. See, they got somebody in there. They heard them. All of a sudden, they don't want to help them. West 842. West 201. Let's see. So they got them in the back seat. Fort Worth, West 8290. Over here in River Oaks. Here's the other River Oaks. 2106. So the ambulance arrives and the fire truck leaves. That's what they did. So someone's in the backseat of the guy's car. Which I've seen him pick up medicals before. One, a cop came halfway over here and then he turned around and went back. Okay, so there was someone in the backseat of this car. And they called the ambulance for him. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six. We've got a lot of them over here. But, and all these over here. And then one pulled up and left. So, why would they call now? What? Who's in the back seat? Is it a guy or is it a cop? Is it a guy or a cop in the back seat? 
why would they all just show up right here? We're like in River Oaks. We're not even in Fort Worth. We're not even in Fort Worth. It's on West Division. It's on West Division. So I called an ambulance for the guy in the backseat of this car over here. Oh, somebody in custody. Somebody in custody. They probably got some little bit beat up. So it's probably somebody in custody and they didn't want to take him to the jail. It's probably already dead. Shouldn't your car run in. You shouldn't get cleaned up. The rope. Doesn't say anything. Damn it. What y'all do? Kill somebody in custody? Did you kill somebody in custody? What's up? So what could it be? There he goes. Hey, where's Tobar at tonight? Tobar. Did they beat up somebody in custody? Is that what they did? Why would they need this many vehicles? They got, they're covering something up. They're conspiring. Yeah. Did y'all beat somebody up in custody? We got it now. Why do y'all have this many? But why are they way over here? This makes no sense. We just want to make sure that our patient's going to get there alive. We should go to the jail, Sally Port. See if they have to pull him out, like carry him in. Or if he walks in. We should go to the Sally Port. We should go to the Sally Port and see if they... He didn't get any ambulance. We should see if they carry him in or if, they, if he walks in the jail. Let me give their shot. So they're all they're all like discussing right here. We got the guy in the back seat of this car right here. They called the ambulance to check on him. So I'm wondering if we should go to the Sally Port and see if he walks in or if they have to carry him in. But why aren't wasn't he riding in the ambulance, I wonder. So we don't know if he's gonna ride in the ambulance or if he's gonna ride in the back of the cop car, because he's in the back of the cop car now. And why would so many of them show up? Also, I saw one come this way and turn around and go that way. I saw how many was here. Like when I was walking over here. They're conspiring now. Why are they conspiring for so long? They're getting our story straight. You know they're on body cam. That's how that's how Taylor Stevens got caught. She was the one that, you know, was the ringleader to get them all done through the stories to match. That's how Taylor Stevens got fired. And they rehired her. And they rehired her. And then it's like, oh shit, my guy's not breathing anymore. I gotta pull over. And then all these guys pull up too. And two River Oaks are already, they're both left. Why would River Oaks leave? Oh, they're like, well, they don't want to be involved in this. Yeah. So this is River Oaks. So two River Oaks police officers just left because they don't want to be involved in this. They don't want no part of this. So we got five cars from Fort Worth. Two from River Oaks that left. Like they just got scared and left. One that was coming this way but turned around. But they're taking a long time to conspire. They need to get a me medical help, I guess. If they're not gonna get a medical help, why they still, it must not be that bad if they're still standing around. He was just overheated. It's the West Division, so this is somewhere, over, it's like Benbrook maybe, the area. Well, we just made that U-turn and came back and they were here. What you guys gonna, what you guys gonna do now? I thought they were organizing to run up in someone's house. Huh? I thought they were organizing to run up in someone's house. I know, I did too. Until I seen them pulled up over here. Can't hear a word they're saying with all their engines running. That's probably why they leave the, run the engines running. So you can't hear. Boy, River Oaks took off quick, didn't they? Yeah. Now they're dispersing. Let's go. There they go. We're leaving. We're going to make sure.
Hey, Sergeant, can I have the incident report number to this? Hey, what's your name and your badge number? Hey, sir, excuse me. Can I have the incident number? Can I have the incident number to this? No. Why not? None of your business. You're not involved. See, y'all some hoes. That's why nobody respects bitches well, like- What do you think? Do you think this is all an innocent little get together or are they hiding something bigger? Why are they out of their jurisdiction in River Oaks instead of Fort Worth? To me, not giving an incident number means they got something to hide. What do you think? And why are we considered the bad guys? Why are we always considered the bad guys? Because we want the answers. We want to know what's going on in the backseat of that patrol car. We want to know why they're in River Oaks. Why are we the bad guys for wanting to know and for wanting them to be transparent? Somebody tell me, why are we the bad guys? We'll get you as much information as we can, as soon as we can.